Hello, my name is Austin Brown, and I'm a co-founder of the Global Air Drone Academy, also known as GATA, a 501c3 nonprofit which uses drones to teach students about STEM education. According to the National Science Foundation, minorities, primarily Black and Hispanic men and women, represent less than 20% of the total STEM workforce, which leads to a loss in earnings, both individually and for these communities. So our mission is to inspire those same underrepresented students to pursue STEM education, STEM careers, and to become leaders in their communities. Our leadership is headed by myself, Aino Lumo, an FAA licensed drone pilot with business development experience, and Victor Akenum, who serves as our executive director and is an engineer by trade. Now, I can honestly say that I myself shied away from math as a student until I saw how the drone industry was taking off. Now I'm an FAA licensed drone pilot who's taught thousands of children about STEM and pursuing their dreams. We have a staff of 10 amazing instructors who facilitate our classes, a program coordinator who oversees administration of classes as well as internships, and a board of directors, which includes myself, Aino, and three other members with a range of experience in policy, law, and education. The problem is that there's a tsunami of jobs coming to the tune of 3.5 million, many of which will go unfulfilled due to a lack of qualified candidates. Now we know that many of those potential candidates come from underrepresented groups in our communities. Studies have shown that 77% of teens are interested in pursuing a STEM career, but a similarly large number also cite a lack of confidence as a reason why they never pursue STEM education. According to the Observatory Journal, people of color often lack access to financial resources, the STEM-focused education, making their college track more difficult. Our solution to this problem is the Junior Drone Pilot Program, a tiered learning system which builds the confidence of students through a series of workshops, competitions, and field trips free of charge to the students and their families. The students ascend through our program, moving from cadet to ace, they will hone their skills, obtain certificates, and most importantly, build the confidence needed to pursue their dreams. So how does it work? We know that there are many corporations in need of STEM workers who want to diversify their workforce but don't know how to attract the candidates that they need to meet the demands of their board of directors. Their participation in our program means that each student sponsor gets free resources, workshops, and certificates and guidance needed to get them closer to their career goals. Here you can see an overview of some of our partners in the educational sector, the FAA, the U.S. State Department. Baltimore City Rec and Parks, and Baltimore City in general. Through these partners, we've been able to reach over 7,000 students already. But for us to have the lasting impact that our communities deserve, we need the commitment of our corporate sponsors, such as the ones listed here, some of which have already engaged with us to support our new initiative. To the right, you can see the Vice Commander of Andrews Air Force Base, which hosted us last month, as well as Mayor Brandon Scott of Baltimore and Secretary Pete Buttigieg of the U.S. Department of Transportation both of which recently visited us to fly drones with our students. Now for our theory of change. Simply put, with the help of our corporate sponsors, we can provide students with year-round access to engage in STEM activities and workshops. These are valuable opportunities to build confidence, develop skills, and give them access to industry experience in the form of internships and apprenticeships, which will lead to licensing and certifications, ultimately getting them into higher earning careers, which will benefit our communities. Here on the left, you can see a 12-year-old student of ours, Chandler, handling a drone for one of the first times in his life. On the right, you can see a 16-year-old student, Chandler again, and now he's the one controlling the drone. Chandler is one of many students who wants to get his drone pilot's license. We make sure the students with all STEM-related ambitions get value out of our program. And here's how we're different. We believe GATA is proud to be the market leader because no other competitor is as focused on industry partnership facilitate the de development of the students as we are. Not only do we provide internships and train students for licensing, but we can guide our students to opportunities created by years of industry experience. Additionally, we are a minority-led organization, and as is often said, you can't be what you can't see, and we intend to change that. And now I'm gonna turn it over to our executive director, Victor Kennel. Thanks, Austin. I'm going to jump right into our social impact and how we measure it. We teach students STEM using cutting edge drone technologies. Thus far, we have taught over 500 STEM after school programs. Our students have built 
2,500 drums, and by 2024, we will reach almost 8,000 students. Aggregated metrics indicate that 60% of our students will graduate with STEM degrees compared to the 18% academic average, and 70% of our students will later take their degrees and certifications and enter a STEM job compared to the 32% industry average. STEM careers pay on average over $49,000 more a year than non-STEM jobs. Remember that number because an extra $49,000 a year is life-changing. That difference in pay leads to true impact in a person's lifetime earning potential. It lowers the minority wage gap and ultimately leads to better communities where cyclical and generational economic change can begin to occur. So how do we do it? Today, GATA offers after-school programs, summer camps, conference-style hackathons, and online drone sales. Our customers are schools, community centers, and outreach organizations like the U.S. State Department. Last year, we did an impact study and found that the time we spend with our students in our current program is not enough to get them all the way through the impact phase or the point in which they make a definitive choice to enter a higher paying STEM career. We need years, not weeks. So we began to build out the Junior Drone Pilot Program. The JDP program is GATA's long-term STEM pipeline. That pipeline forms the building blocks of the pyramid that Austin introduced earlier as our theory of change. Students enter a JDP cohort in middle school, and we work with them all the way through high school and into a STEM career or college. The key is that we continuously reinforce and validate STEM principles. Each five-year cohort is sustained by a corporate sponsor. The cohorts compete against each other on various impact metrics as they go through our program, transition into their STEM internships, and complete various projects in the newly proposed JDP Drone Lab. Now let's get to the numbers. We will start with our current financial projections. We are on track to reach $200,000 in revenue by the end of this year. We will build out the capacity for the new JDP program through Q2 of next year, requiring a lot of capital, and launch a JDP program and accept the first cohorts in Q2 of next year. With your investment over a two-year span, we can jumpstart the JDP program, and by 2024, we will have a cash flow positive revenue stream of over $1.5 million. We are seeking $350 over the next two years to build our capacity. We're open to investments in the forms of traditional grants, recoverable grants, as well as loans. By the end of 2023, we will break even, and by end of 2024, we can begin paying back any recoverable grants or loans. Now let's talk about how we can use how your investment. The first year of funding will be used to hire staff, specifically a JDP program manager, an education specialist, a technical writer, and a data metrics and compliance manager. Our new customers for the JDP program are multi-billion dollar institutions with a lot of things competing for space in their annual budgets. So that means we also need to spend some resources to revamp our marketing, design, and customer acquisition approach. In the second year, we'll focus funds on acquiring and equipping the JDP Drone Lab with innovative tools for the inaugural cohort. With your investment, we can reach almost 8,000 students across our legacy programs, as well as our new JDP program. That comes out to $45 per student. Our aggregated metrics indicate that 70% of them will go on to be STEM employed. Plug in the $49,000 into a formula, and we can calculate that the additional income will lead up to a quarter of a billion dollars in annual social impact with our first JDP cohort enters the workforce in 2024. At the Global Red Drone Academy, we firmly believe that the sky is the limit, pun intended. We graciously welcome you to be part of our impact.